What's up guys, how you guys doing? Um, welcome to my channel. If you don't know who I am already, my name is Matthew and I'm currently doing my first year at the University of Auckland. And um, I'm currently staying at Uni Hall Apartments. So uh, I'm just actually in the gym thinking about how last year I didn't know what was what was it like to live at Uni Hall. So uh, I thought you guys might be wondering the same thing too. You're welcome. I'm making this one right now. Let's go with me, shall we? back to the room and uh, it's now 7 a.m. so I'm gonna have to breakfast right now. Never ever forget student ID for meals. Let's go. Now. I'm like, why should she not see me? All? Like, suddenly I'm just like blank. Alright, who are you? Introduce yourself. Okay. Rolling. My name is Melissa, and I'm one of the RAs here at the University Hall. Um, you should come to Uni Hall because um, you get to make, build great communities, meet great people um, from different countries, connect, and yeah, make lifelong friends. Oh, thank you so much, Nelly. No worries. Oh, she's my eye as well, so that's pretty awesome. Thank you. That is awesome, so yeah. <laughs> I'll stress with you. We stress together. We'll stress together. You At know? least we have each other. Yes, exactly. I'll see you later, Bye. Nelly. Bye. Bye. Alright, so I think this is time now. It's the time to check how much stuff have we got from you know from the dining hall right now. Just check out my, my hoodie, man. I have such a big pocket and then perfect for all the things I can steal. Look at all of that. Wow. Okay. Okay. And all of this as well. These are what I stole from yesterday. Not exactly. Well, it's not exactly like stealing, but it's sort of like taking fruits because, you know, university students are supposed to be starving and we are starving all the time. So it's okay, man. It's okay. Just don't waste money on buying fruit. Go to dining hall, get it yourself. That's the number one tip. Let's get it. Tip number two, always and almost always do laundry during the weekdays because during the weekends, man, you can't even find a place to do it. Honestly. Yep, perfect. Gotcha. Nobody's doing it right now. So there's a washing machine down there. There's a dryer up here. Everything here is free. The laundry service within the uni hall is free. No matter where is it, is it in the apartment, is it tower, they're all free for you to get to use. I guess there was a, a money thing lay, like earlier on, but uh, apparently it's not working anymore, so it's all free for now. So maybe use it. <laughs> Once in a while, just be clean, I guess. Alright. Oh no, I forgot the powder. Jeez, give me one second.
so easy. Be expected to see random underwears everywhere in this area. That one right there. Don't even bother touch it, just leave it there. People will come collect it. Alright, heading back now. God, always remember to set a timer for your washing. 45 minutes usually, but uh, it's been 10 minutes now, so say 35. Counting now, 35 minutes. <clears throat> Alright, what's up my people? It's currently 11.05 and actually lunch started at 11.30. So right now I'm just gonna go meet up with the friends and then um see where we go from there. This morning I got a bit of work done, I got a bit of study out of the way and then I also wrote some script and then called my mom and stuff like that. So I'm really feeling happy and productive right now. Let's go with me, shall we? Far side, you can see. Hello, say hi. No? Okay. Yo. I still sort of no? work okay. out at home. Like. <laughs> Priya, say hi. Hi. Nico, say hi. Okay. No, I don't go to the gym. Alright, just like that, we just wrapped up the meal. Uh, lunch was good. We had some burritos tonight, uh, today. It was really good, really good, really good. Um, right now, my evening, my afternoon is sort of chill a little bit. Um, I have a class at 3 p.m. accounting, whatever. Um, so I'm just gonna get ready for that, get a quick nap, and then I'll catch you guys dinner. dinner so uh, right now I'm gonna head to towers to meet up with a friend she's a fellow photographer and uh, we're gonna have a little quick talk about uh, how uni hall is like and we're gonna head to dinner later so I'm gonna take you guys with me let's go Dude, how are you doing? Oh, uh -huh. look at this setup, though. Holy shit! Oh, yeah, this is my crew. I'm trying to remember. Oh, yeah. I used to. 
How's it like living in Taos? How's it like? Ah, uh, that's interesting. Interesting? Yeah, sometimes I actually forget that I'm in Taos. I won't lie. Because, you know, this is kind of like my little sanctuary. So when I oh. walk out, and the first thing I was like, shit, this my boy wears this And then I realized, wait, no, that's wrong. I'm actually living with people. Right. Why did you decide to, to, to stay in uni hall in the first place? Uh, my cousin was actually here. Oh, last cool. Year. Yeah, so um, I looked at Overwalk and I looked at every other place, but this was, um, had a wall, not a brick, <laughs> first of all. Um, second of all, it was like much larger, like the rooms were larger, yeah. the um, cleaning, like the facilities were better. Uh -huh. Yeah, and it was also close, like the closest. True, to, true, um, definitely. get to everywhere. So, so, you know, I had to think. Like the closest place where I can get my shopping, the closest place where I can go out for a drink. You know, all these options that a uni student kind of has to think about. Yeah. Yeah, and transportation is like quite literally right around the corner. Hi. Yes. Did you have any sort of like expectations when you first came here, and were they met by uni hall and stuff like that throughout right. living here? Um, uh, I had absolutely, I had. Actually, I had a couple expectations. Are but you trying to minimize it? Is that what you're trying to say? But it, it was. It had nothing to do with, um, like the space. It was more. I was actually expecting people to be more brutal here. Oh wow. Yeah, because um, yeah, that's what I was expecting it to be a bit of a um, like or like one for all type like, you know every man for themselves type situation so i was really surprised at how like nice people were yeah yeah that was one thing i wasn't expecting besides that i had absolutely no expectations right. coming in yeah because we were just talking talking yesterday and you said like you know in uni hall you feel a sense of brotherhood and sisterhood a lot like yeah. everyone's your cousins your family yeah, members yeah. And i quite literally family as i do one <laughs> <laughs> that's really nice though it's really nice of you to do so yeah yeah everyone's part of the um whanau. Oh, right, fine now. That's right. That's the word. That's the one word I know in Maori. I know. I know. Uh, Kelda. Kelda. That's two. Can you say word with no? Just how do you say Maori exactly? Cause like I'm I'm doing this this vlog sort yeah. of like video. I'm trying to make this at least biased as possible, not just from my perspective, but yeah. also from others as well, from towers, from apartments and stuff. So yeah. Yeah, cause towers and apartments definitely have different vibes. Yeah, yeah. The best way to describe it, it's like. When you're at apartments, you're with your immediate family. When you're at towers, you're with your um like distant relatives. Yeah. Oh, true. Yeah. It's so like true, right? Because yeah. it's so homely over at apartments. Yeah. But there's just so many people at towers that like, it constantly feels like you're at that family gathering where you know absolutely fucking nothing. Holy shit! I'm literally have goosebumps right now. Yeah. That was so true. Like, that was so true. Oh my god. Damn. All right. All right. Yeah. All right. Last one. Any um personal tips and tricks advices on how to live in uni hall have like you know a memorable experience i think um probably taking time i think the scariest thing is when especially when you know no one here you kind of try to jump into a free group like even if mm. it doesn't actually work for you you try to find Just blend like, in. yeah you try to find like a sense of belonging even if those people don't flow with you if you right. don't flow with those people so i'd say take your time there will always be like great people where you don't actually expect it um oh my god i have goosebumps again jesus also i think um especially in living in a big place it can be scary and sometimes you can feel quite alone but the, like the ra's the, um if not the ra's like the director it would actually help a lot them being boo and they're almost the best way to describe it it's like if you don't want to go to counseling but you want someone to listen to you mm. or if you just want to spend time with someone definitely like talk to the staff because it would take time out of their day especially if you're like because they can help you if you have any personal problems or exam problems or they they might even be able to direct you to certain places that might help more so yeah I think those will be some tips. I got a lot more, but those are not age appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, let's give it PG 13. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm here to be um, real sentimental. Yo. Thank you for party tricks for another time. Alright, alright, alright. That was sick.
It's currently 7.46 p.m. right now and I just want to say thank you so much for sticking into the end of this video. I really genuinely appreciate you guys. Um, a few things just want to say before wrapping up this video is that, first of all, this video, everything you just saw, every single thing that I just put in this video is not 100% representation of how we do things here in, 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 in Uniho. Um, you know, I try my best to include everything but that is by far almost impossible. Secondly, I, I in this video you can see that I try my best to sort of to stay away from being biased as best I could by including different people perspective on how you know how things are here in Uni Hall instead of just giving my own perspective. And as far as my experience goes, I just want to say that I really, really love Uni Hall. It makes my experience at the University of Auckland as a first year much much easier in terms of transitioning from high school to university and to real life in a long term. So yeah, I really appreciate I really appreciate and enjoy the time I live here. And I if you guys keen just maybe check it out and give it a shot next year. Um so that should be it for today's video. Um yeah if this video has helped you at all in any sort of way, maybe consider give it a like or subscribe. If you want to see my face around your YouTube page, you know what to do. It's your choice, your decision. You know, take it or leave it. Anyhow, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.